Hey guys, and welcome back to Club Penguin Imagine. So as you guys can see, the Halloween party 2024 has begun. It is 1.04 a.m. on October 27th. And they just released the party now. Let's get started. The same screen can be also seen here. Oh, hey, they updated this screen. Nice. I remember that from the uh, uh, original Club Penguin in 2016. Okay, there we go. I knew there was a pop-up there because I had a sneak peek. Here's a welcomes to the Halloween party. Right now we're in a bit of a tricky situation. Old Skips has taken over Gary Walt's mansion. Whole place is on lockdown until we can get inside. In the meantime, with all these tricks, why not a tree? I've hidden some candy all across the island with some riddles. There's a good there's a grand prize if you find them all. Happy Halloween! Nice! So that can explain what this icon's for. And we already have the pumpkin basket because we mainly got it from the ghost buffalo a while back. So, yeah. Now I'm pretty sure if we didn't have that, we could have attained, obtained that there. Oh hey, Dark Tanger's actually over here. Dude, that's so cool! Nice way to put it in. You know what? Frick it, let's actually do this. I completely forgot how this worked. It's been forever since I've been in here. Oh, come on! Please work. Yeah, there we go! <laughs> it's been forever since I've done this. I know. Just completely forgot how this works. Okay, I think I got this. I think I got this. Dang it! Please be it. Please be it. Come on! Oh yeah, we got a friend request. Yes. Oh, that's them. Hey, we got it! So, we just had to, of course, press the green one. Oh, wait, got it. There we go. Finally. That took forever to finally get. My God. It did not need to take that long. Nice, let's go. And yeah. Of course, we got the Storm Lantern. Actually, pretty cool. Let's put that on. Now, I'm pretty sure if you have the night vision goggles, I think you can actually get through this without even having the lantern in the first place. Unfortunately, since I don't think I have that, we are physically not able to do that. Unless, of course, again, I had it, but I don't think I do. I'll have to get it from probably like the EBF catalog. Also, hopefully, I'm going to. Yeah, I knew it. I haven't done this even in so long that even I'm forgetting. Let's go! There we go. Oh, dude, and we even got the Kermit costume, too. But we also got the Swap Monster costume at the exact same time. Which is so cool! Oh wait, that's right, I think there's a catalog here. That's right, we can buy literally everything. I got like, I think enough points for literally everything in this catalog. Which is actually really cool. Like, I think I can literally buy everything in this catalog. costume, but I already have it somehow. Pretty cool. Pretty cool catalog. I think I've seen it before. Well, uh, that's over with now. Oh, dude, it's been forever since I've heard this music. 
it has been forever since I've heard this music specifically. Dude, that's so good to hear again. Is this the same? Yeah. Well, the difference is that, of course, it's nighttime now. That's mainly the difference now. Outside of that, there's nothing else. Okay, outside of the music here, though, that's cool. Wait a second, I think this is actually supposed to be playing on the roof. I think they got it mixed up here. That's fine, though. Let's get out of here. Oh, hey, we got the... What did disco music play? Or whatever this was called. Okay, this has nothing. Yo, we updated the map! I mean, only one is available. Which I think is actually one of the staff members. What a coincidence. Okay, this actually looks freaking awesome! In all seriousness, let's continue. Yep, it's up to here too. I do see all the pumpkins here as well, which is super, super cool. Also, I remember this music too. I heard it mostly in Clubbing and Remastered. Who remembers that game? I don't think this is decorated. No! What about out here? Oh, yep, it's updated. It's updated. I see all the pumpkins. Next up is the snow forts. Of course, we got the neighborhood like usual. Pretty cool. It's just... The only thing I do still find weird, though, is just... The candy stage is not being here. Like, granted, that was for the majority of the Halloween parties that had this design. From, like, 2014 to 2016. So, yeah. And then, of course... You know, stadium obviously, I think. Yeah, they should have sneak peeked this like a few hours beforehand. So, that's cool. Let's continue. Next up we have is the town. Which, yes, they still have the anniversary decorations on the inside, ain't you? That? Yep, they said that this is going to be going until the Halloween party is over. So, yeah. Up here is slightly different. However, that also exists. Because if we go down here, as we can see, the lab is open. Beautiful. And of course, this mainly features the same catalog we saw earlier in the dark chamber. Very, very cool. All right, I think next up we're gonna go to the night club. Obviously up here, of course, obviously has this. Okay, now in here. Is the ruins back to normal? Hey, you can adopt ghost puffles, even though I already have one. Speaking of which, why do I not have them with me? Yeah, I'm gonna need you, bud. That's better. I'll probably adopt another one during this party. But yeah. Oh, I did not mean to go to the ski village, but you know what? Whatever, it's decorated. It's really, really cool. Of course, obviously the ski lodge is decorated as well. And then if we go up here, well, the only thing that's mainly updated is just the window, most like nothing here. The ski village, though, uh, sorry, ski hill is updated as you would expect. Now here we are at the beach where uh, lots of people happen to ironically be. Let's do that. Oh, dude. That is so cool. They actually made a custom interface for this. That's so cool. I'm not gonna lie. That is so cool. Dude. And I'm pretty sure it's all free, so... Yeah. Dang. Seriously, it's really not been that long since we've seen this. We saw this back in August. In Journey. So yeah, it hasn't been that long. But now it's the appropriate time of year to actually see this. Which is awesome. Well, that's set though. Let's continue the tour respectively. 
Yep, they got all three in here. Let's go. Of course, they obviously have the beacon decorated as you would expect, which is honestly really cool. And that's not updated, but that is completely fine. Here we have the mine, which is pretty cool. And then I think we also have the school here as well, which of course looks like this. Looks like very, very, very nice. Oh, I think I also just saw one of the candies over there. Nothing here outside of the sky and music. And of course, this is obviously the pumpkin as we all knew. This is cool though. I legitimately remember all of these rooms. That's awesome. Oh, hey, this is updated music wise. And lighting wise. Of course, we obviously got the cove down here, which is awesome as usual. Yo, the toy UFO! I could be wrong. I'm trying to remember this. Also, yes, I did try to remember something else. You're welcome. <laughs> he doesn't want it to ever end. Oh, actually, how long does this go? Okay, so according to the Discord server, this goes until November 9th. Whoa, that is a long time. That goes way past Halloween. But hey, I ain't complaining. Here. It's just crazy. Oh, yeah, that's right. The player cards are different when you transform. I remember that. And once again, I think it's time to go finally hunt for the candy now. And I'm referring to this. Okay, so this first one. Have you ever visited our scarecrow friend? He's got some candy for you. You should reach the hill's end. That, of course, is here on the ski hill. Okay, so in order for the candy to load, you need to wear the pumpkin basket, which you can get via this interface that we saw earlier. Now that that is done, this candy's bar got itself in a bit of a goof. You can find it on a neighborhood roof. This candy can be hidden all the way over here. Now, you'll actually have to refresh it to actually be able to get it to load, so do keep that in mind. You'll have to click it twice after that. Next up, beware where you swim. You, uh, should you go in the slide, this candy's by a chair in a ring to save those in time. That is located here in the uh, underground pool. Specifically, right here. Oh, and yeah, I actually forgot about this room. Sorry about that. And this room, too. I seriously do apologize, guys. As for the next candy, however, you'll find this delight on the edge of a room. You'll find it just outside of Moto's stove. Okay, that is clever. <laughs> it's in the plaza, but my god, that is so clever. That is so clever. <laughs> Oh, you'll enjoy this Halloween hat. There's a free piece of candy hiding on a snack shack. That, just for the record, is located all the way up here. Okay, and now they're now loading without me needing to click twice. Interesting. There's nothing more scenic than the hollow moon. Why not sit at the table outside the vampire's room? That candy is located over here in the mine shack, which is also pretty clever. Over here, this next one is this. Someone must have been spooked to drop their tree. You'll find it in an arcade just at your feet. That is located all the way over here in the corner. You may not see it at first. Okay, that time I had to reload it a second time. As for this one, watch out for the machine of monsters that'll scare you pale. Look for the candy out by an ocean's sail. That one is all the way over here. Really, really cool. And this is what we get for completing it. The Halloween Scar. Let's pick that up. And obviously, let's go ahead and put that on. That looks awesome! Like it always is. Seriously, that's so cool! That's so cool, man. Well, we completed the candy hunt. Okay, the zombie is one of the only ones to stop and done. So, yeah. I still love this thing! Hmm. 
That's like, these things are great. Remember all these things. Seriously, these things were all really cool. I don't know why. This one's just cool for some reason. Oh yeah, that's right. The robot one. That's right. <laughs> I'm glad I wasn't doing that all in all like all cats. That would have been really freaking weird. Oh! Actually, yeah. There's one other thing. You notice how they just did that? Well, watch when we throw snowballs. That's right. The snowballs have actually changed in this party. That's really cool. Oh! And I guess they just told us about certain parts of the screen that we have. Watch. Oh, ho, ho, ho. so there's way more of this than we thought. Yeah, there are way more of these than we thought. Whoa! Alright, let's keep finding these secret transformations. Okay, I just found another one right down here. We're Kermit now. I freaking love it. Oh, oh, is there more? Please, please let there be more. Oh, I think I just found the third one. Yes. Seriously. It's beautiful. You'll be freezing by chance. Let's go. Oh, I just found the fourth one! God, they, they hide these so well. I freaking love it. Uh, dude. It's great! I didn't think they would have had these in, but my god, I love them! And remember them too, because they all come from the original game. Okay, so I do not see any more here. Those were the only four secret transformations. For now, though, I think we're done. Or are we? That's right, they reskinned all the minigames, or at least the majority of minigames, for Halloween. And I might make a standalone video discussing how all of these work. But my god, this is incredible! They did a great job on this. Whoa! Hold on just a second, everybody. Sorry. Give me just a minute. I did not know what the heck just happened there. I know I crashed, but the recording screen just went up for some reason. Give me a second. There we go. It is fixed. And we landed in the tap. Okay, so not literally everything. Fine by me. I think I recall this one being reskinned. Sure is. They literally reskinned this whole freaking game. And I'm only doing this just to show you how it looks. First off, this looks amazing. But I'm doing that just to mainly show you. Nothing else to say here. And this got updated too. Nice. Yes, that includes here too. Let's go. This all looks awesome. They did such a good job with this. That actually looks amazing. Oh yeah, I forgot about the robots on the player card. I just freaking love that the Olaf transformation is here. It's because that all the secret transformations are freaking funny. Because they're just here randomly. I want to see if anything else has been redone. Yes, it's been redone because I can see the sky being updated. Nice. So it is slightly different. Well, to some extent. Actually, I think it might, might just be just the sky itself. Where the frick did the recording just go? Uh... Okay, I just fixed it. I have no idea what happened. I think I heard that sled racing was redone too. Of course, in order to actually see it, we need to have more people here. Maybe if I'm missing some? Yeah! 
Yeah, let's go. Give me just a second. We need to see this. We need to see this. See? I told you I wasn't kidding about that. I wasn't kidding. They actually redid sled racing. Legitimately. Why can't I move, by the way? Where the frick is my mouse? Why am I not able to move all of a sudden? Uh, I'm not able to move. Why am I not able to move? That's weird. That's weird. Oh well. Probably just a bug. <laughs> I just love how cool this is. Some reason. It's freaking awesome. I love every freaking bit of that. It's great. It is genuinely great. Seriously, they did an incredible job on all the mini games they did that they redone for the Halloween part. Seriously, they did. So much! Oh, was this one redone? Let's see. Heck yeah, it was! Let's go! Woo! Oh, I don't think I've actually played this on here. I don't think I've actually played Catching Waves on Imagine yet. That's probably why I'm earning all these stamps. But, yep! And they redid it all! Anyway guys, I think that actually wraps up this video because first of all, it's like uh, nine minutes to like uh, midnight. Yeah, this is only week one. Yeah, I'm aware. Yep, I am aware of that. <laughs> yeah, because they said on Discord there is a lot more to come with this part, which is actually Really freaking cool. No wonder it goes for a while. It's pretty awesome. This party is genuinely amazing. First off, they reskinned all the mini games, which they didn't even need to do, but they did anyway, because they're awesome. And secondly, this party just overall, as of right now, because they said there's gonna be a second week content, but as of right now, this party is amazing, and we definitely know the second half is going to be probably even more epic. So with all of that being said, guys, if I did miss any mini games that were redone for Halloween, please comment down below. If I missed anything else with the party that I didn't cover here, please comment down below that as well. Until then, see you next time!